Hello everybody, welcome to our channel, Recognizing Our Rights, a place that aims to showcase the best constitutional audits. And today we want to recommend that you go subscribe to Georgia Constitution Media and let them know that Recognizing Our Rights said hello, as I'll be leaving links down below to his channel and the original video, because this guy has simply improved over time to not only know the laws very well, but he still remains humble and professional with any law enforcement officer he encounters, just like in the video you're about to see. But before I jump into today's content, do not forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button and that notification bell to let you know when we upload new videos. With all that out of the way, let's jump right into this interaction. Malibu, Malibu Classic. Oh, I'm just looking around, checking everything out. Huh? Why's that? Because you shouldn't be up here videoing corners. Makes you look suspicious. What you gonna do, try to come back and steal something? Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Well, that would be fine. I'm right here on the sidewalk. Georgia Liner. Automotive. Ain't on the sidewalk, you're on the property. I'm asking you to go down the road. Well, I'm on, I'm on the side of the road now. Okay. There ain't no sidewalk over here. You need to get off the property. You make yourself look bad. I ain't making myself look bad. You're doing something you shouldn't be doing. Well, you ever heard of the First Amendment? I'm going to ask you one more time to go on down the road. Well, I'm going to ask you one more time to respect my First Amendment and let me do what I'm here to do, and I'll be on my I'm way. I'm here to do nothing. I'm asking you to leave. No. Leave. No. How are you? No harm, no foul. I'm just out here you, doing some free advertisement for the people, and they didn't want no free advertisement. Okay, so, you, um, yeah, we got a call about your videotape yeah, on their yeah, property. Just, do you have no, I'm not on their property. I never step on the bus. Oh, property. okay. No, sir. No, that, I've just got the call. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah, yeah, I'm just letting you know. You have a driver? Or a well, I don't show my ID. I don't do nothing wrong. You understand? I'm, I'm filming in public, giving people free advertisement, and they approach me. And if you could just tell them that I'm not doing anything wrong. and yeah, But you weren't on the property. No, no, sir. I, I'm very careful not to do that. I'll pull GIS surveys and been doing this a long time. What are you videoing for, if you don't mind me asking? First Amendment. Protected activity. Just, just doing like Just that. do. Just, yeah. Free advertisement. Do you live around here? Um, are you from here? I, I just, I no, I'm, I'm, no, I'm no, no. I'm not from around here. Most people know me. I do this. I go around and... You know, okay. show people right, wrong, wrong from right, and you know when they say they call the yeah, police, we, we I don't, I don't read. Yeah, yeah. Um, but you were never on, on the property. No, I'm very close. Never ever to do that. Matter of fact, as far as I was, right there at the edge of the curtilage, the uh, GAS survey starts. Okay, if you just explain to them I'm not doing nothing wrong, and we'll be good to go. What was your name, badge number? That sheriff deputy stated that he got a phone call about Georgia Constitution Media being on private property. Don't you just love it how people like to lie? You obviously know I'm not talking about the cops in this case, even though they do show their sheer pignorance later on in this video, but I digress. Even after the plethora of audits I've seen, it still shocks me that nobody not even the private citizens themselves seem to understand what a public easement is. Sure, Georgia Constitution Media was walking across their driveway, but he was still close to the road, and a professional auditor like him knows how to check GIS surveys. But it's unfortunate that not even the people understand that he had a right to do what he was doing, and soon we'll see that the cops don't understand that either. So let's jump right into that, shall we? Thank you, sir, for honoring your oath. What was your name and badge number? Uh, my name is Deputy Ferris. And he's come over here because yeah. he, he can't be on their property. Well, see, let me, let me show you this, oh, and I'm going to get out of your way. Just put more on well, the, off the road. That way we'll right. Out. See the telephone poles? Yeah. Telephone poles, usually 95% of the time, <clears throat> it's going to be your public property line. Yeah. And then you do the GAS survey. It's going to be somewhere between 23, 26 foot, foot from center. It's going to give you a curtilage, and the curtilage is going to give you two yeah, and a half. Over foot. here, this is this is not no, their property, but the the parking lot where their cars are. At, it starts right. It starts right about where his tire is. Yes, sir. Well, I'm very careful. At, it starts at the parking lot, so they just don't. As long as you, you can video, you, you have every right. right to video. Right. I you don't. Know. I don't. Yeah, I don't want to. I'm just, I just want this to be able so you can go. But it starts where that car is. Okay. See the telephone poles. I'm not going yeah. back over there. I'm just yeah, trying to, you yeah, know. That's why they call it. I, right, I, I don't, right. Yeah, well, that's what I'm trying to teach them, right from wrong, yeah, wrong from right. but if you're in the parking lot, that's what they were concerned about. Right, yeah, well, now they know that that's yeah. where their property starts. And 
you know. So okay. Well, thank you for telling me. I'll call you up there earlier. Just don't. Yeah, that's all I'm doing. Yeah, you just free advertise if, 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 if you're on somebody's property and they don't want to show right. there, that, that's, that's their, they own that property. I right. can't. That's right. All. But again, that's what I'm, I'm so that, that's the difference between me going to jail and getting trespassed and not getting trespassed. Well, no, it's not, it's not, they, just, they were just wondering what you were doing. Right. And I told them what I was doing. See, they. They, they have their cars get broken into. We have like inner and autos and stuff. That's right. why. They, 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 and if you're well, I understand people that. Video, that, that but I told them, and usually I don't tell yeah, them. But I told I, them this I, time. But yeah, it starts right there, and you know, I hope you learned something. You know, but be safe, brother. Georgia Power can't come on your property unless. Uh, oh, hi. You? You hey, buddy, you doing all right? Good to I see am. you. What's your name, badge number? Deputy Waters. Waters. Okay. Nine, four, five, two, four. Okay. That's out doing public photography, looking around, giving some free advertisement, and I didn't want to leave when they. Call the police is on me, you know. Okay. Well, what is it that you're looking for? Free advertisement. Just giving people free advertisement. Mm -hmm. Taking video, taking pictures in public. You know, it, our rights were so important. To, you know, they made the First Amendment the first one instead of, you know, so if you don't exercise your rights, they're going to go away. And that's just all I'm doing. Right. Been well, doing it a while. Yeah, well, you know, when, they, when you're on private property. You know, well, I, I never, I never, never. I'll be honest with you. I I got the GIS survey. The the <clears throat> their property line starts. You got the I was telling him you got the curtilage, you got the center line, then you count I think 23 feet back, and then the best way to do it is go by the telephone poles. No telephone poles is going to be on private property. So anytime you get your no, I stand right there on that curtilage. Uh, yeah, as far as I go, man. Been doing this a long time. I know right from wrong, wrong, right. That's what I try to teach people. Now, I walked all the way down this road, and I got a lot of good phone numbers. They might get some phone calls. They might say, man, good job, and if you need some paint and body work, but just people here just don't believe did in the first minute. And, and I told them what I was doing. What, what did they say to you when it came out? Uh, get out of here. We don't want you here. You might be trying to steal something. Um, get off my property, and I explained to him where I was, and then I come over here on this side and wait on him and then be on my way. Yeah, that's what I do, man. I do this all over the all over the place, you know. Right. Having fun, taking pictures. I mean, look, you got a Nova, you got a Firebird, old as me and you. Who wouldn't want to see that? That's gonna get a lot of people to watch it, you know. All right. Well, y'all be safe. Or well, just hang tight for me for okay. a minute. Okay. Goodbye. Um, have you? Have, has, did you give him some ID? I don't have to do that. That's what another thing I was playing to him. Um, unless I've broken the law, you don't have to ID in the state of Georgia. Um, you know, am I being detained? Well, for the moment, yes. For what crime? Until we find out what's going on. To what crime am I being committed? We were called because you were on their property. Right, and he determined I wasn't. Okay. Just am hang, I tight, still, hang tight. Just a minute, we'll get you out of here. Am I being okay? detained for an unlawful reason? Yes or no? Right now, you're being detained because you were on their property, and we're trying to find out what's going on. Okay, and I can prove that I wasn't on their property, and they can't prove that I was. Or, you know, there again, I mean issue me a trespass i'll be on my way and then we'll go to court but you know this ain't my first rodeo can i get a supervisor yes sir unless i'm being not being detained i'm free to go i'll leave I'll stay here for mm -hmm. okay they don't want you to come back on their property have you provided us with any good information i've never been on their property okay well it's private property i've yeah, never been on their property hang on. okay if they advise us they don't want you on your property, that's fine. we're going to tell you that you can't go on their property. That's fine. Okay, can I see your ID, please? You don't have to have my ID okay, to I, issue a trespass. I, yes, sir, I do. I need to identify if you're, you. Uh, under threat of arrest, I'll give my ID. I'm with any supervisor, so they all don't get in trouble. Okay. Okay. Oh, careful, careful, careful. Holy crap. <sighs> We just so we can document it. We just want to I understand that, but why survive. would you violate my rights? That's my Fourth Amendment right. They're no, violating all, my First all, Amendment. All we got, we we got a call. We had to respond. Right, they're but I didn't call but, you. But they're stating you were on their property. That's why I went and talked to them. They said that where because you when I walked back over, you were standing on their property. No, I was standing right there. Yeah, you were standing in the parking lot. I'm telling you what I saw, and it, I'm just telling you they told me you were on their property. That's why I asked. I talked to both parties. Well, issue me a trespass. Well, I don't have your ID. I can't. Under threat of arrest, I'll give my ID. You said you would provide your idea. No, I don't I have to. It's a fourth amendment violation. Well, we went on six okay. Months. God, man, you you gonna believe them? What if they tell you I was naked in the street? Why would you I got I got the camera footage from twenty eight minutes ago. You seen me walking. I can prove everything. You I, know what I saw you in the other people's property filming too. Right there, on the edge, the 
this is, this is, this, you can be over here, but that, the park lot where their cars are at is their property. I could pull it up for you. Pull up GIS survey, Columbia County. Before we get ourselves in trouble, pull it up and they'll show you the marked places. I'm not familiar with what you're doing. GIS survey on yeah, ColumbiaCounty.gov. It's, it's easy, okay. you just put okay, it in. We'll wait on the okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't want to get in trouble for something I didn't do. That's crazy. I do this, listen, I do this for a living. Well, that's kind of shocking. I mean, I hate to tell you that, but this ain't my first rodeo. How long can you legally detain somebody? 20 minutes? So let me ask you another question. Sorry, if they um, file a police report saying I was on their property and it's proved that I wasn't, is that filing a false police report? No, sir. Okay. Because at this point, all they want is for you to be issued a trespass warrant, in which case we warning. need to identify you. Warning. Warning. That's you, the first time, you have to be, I had to be told to get off their property and leave. Second time, I had to be ID'd. Third time, go to jail. No, sir. Okay. What do you think? Well, I mean, how, what, what once, do you... How once do you, I advise you not to return to their property... Right. If you come back, you can be arrested for... Absolutely. After you tell me to leave. That's correct. You're telling me to leave. Okay, but I still need to identify you before... So we, so the next time you show up, we'll have your information already. I get a chance to leave before I can be, my rights can be violated in the state of Georgia. Or I would have been ID'd 22 minutes ago or in the back of that car. Listen, I told him, you were sitting in an auditorium some. You All don't right. want to talk to me. I'm not well, no, no, I just. I don't know why you're videotaping and stuff, so we'll let you oh, Smith v. Cummins is why. That's fine. You know what Smith v. Cummins is? Not, not off right it's, off it's, hand. You don't know? Not right off hand, though, sir. I'd have to. Oh. It's, um, that's why we, I'm just telling you why we got a call out here. We're not just out here. We didn't, I, and, I, I saw know. you over there, but they, they called us, and that's why we're here. And I'll let you talk to the supervisor when he gets here. Right. Everybody. Smith v. Cummins, give us the right. That's case law. Give us the right to film my public officials and public servants in the course of their duty from start to finish yeah, I don't, I don't have okay a well that's you filming that's, me and stuff but they for some reason they had a problem with you being on their property well then they don't like the first amendment here, here i'm gonna say this I, is I you don't i know them, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna talk this way you said in the auditorium maybe a courthouse somewhere you raise your hand put your hand on the bible in front of maybe mom brother cousin some people that really proud of you and you know what you did you swore an oath you swore an oath to the united states of america and right now you are violating my fourth amendment you're trying to violate Fourth Amendment. You're violating my First Amendment, and you're illegally detaining me in the state of Georgia. Why don't you just think about what you're doing? Think about what's going on. They can't prove nothing. You tell me, cut the camera off, show me where you was, and you're free to go. You can't say that. You're going to take somebody's word for it. I got the proof right here. You know I do. You've been watching me. You swore an oath. You swore an oath. And I'm asking you to honor your oath right now. Let me be free to go like you should. Well, I just need to know who you are, so I have to document That's a situation. violation of my Fourth it's Amendment. Not a yes, it is. I'm supposed to be free in my papers and. Well, he said you wanted to talk to Superbike, so that's what we're going to wait on. No, I ain't, unless I'm being detained. I told him if I'm not being detained. Your supervisor can pull up GIS survey if he wants to. It starts right there, 2.7 feet. Morning, sir. How are you? What was your name and badge number, sir? Staff Sergeant Johnson, 93159. Hey, Johnson. I was explaining Sorry. to them, I'm out here exercising my rights, First yes, Amendment right. Um, private property starts about 1.2 foot on the other side of that telephone pole per government um, document um, survey. Well, okay. Anyway, I did my homework. I'm down here giving some people free appetite, but they called the police to me. This deputy here legally detained me for 18 minutes and 32 seconds. For no suspicion or nothing. He told me that I had to show him my identification to be, to be trespassed. I explained to him I was on the privilege of that road right there. Their property starts at the front tire of that uh, VW. Okay. And I'm trying to exercise my rights. Both of them gentlemen stood in a auditorium or courthouse with their hand on a Bible and they swore an oath okay. to protect my civil rights. Yes. He's wanting my Fourth Amendment violated. He's wanting my First Amendment violated. And they called the police to me and lied. I got 28 minutes of video. It shows me doing exactly what I'm doing right now on public property, exercising my right as an American. So and it, and any time that you go on that property? No, sir. I'll, be, I, I'll, I'll look. He knows, he knows exactly who I am. Which one? To the left. Okay. And and, and I told him I'm going to file a formal complaint on him and him. And y'all have never, ever had a problem with Columbia County. Right. Ever. And once you realize who I am and what I'm doing, and, right. and it, it really makes y'all look bad, man. And I'm illegally detained for no crime.
that that's that's a so when they got the call they got the call from right the business owner. right and to this second this deputy here to this second says that their property starts in the road that he's seen me own the property that's what's causing the uproar i got you. that's what's causing the uproar he don't know where gis survey starts you can't put a fence up and keep georgia power out you can't put a fence up and keep um you know the fire hydrants out that's what you know that's what i'm doing and i'd like to be on my way safe in my papers and you know yeah. that's where i'd like to be I got you. i've been detained too long for a crime i hadn't committed and these people think it's funny and well, as long as you haven't been on their property that's fine absolutely because you're outside their property and i mean you're legally doing what you need absolutely to do can here. you explain that to them uh, so I'm they gonna, don't um, violate our, anybody else's rights? Right? They don't want you on their property. Absolutely, so I, and I don't go on their property. That's why they were just saying a criminal trespass warning. So you've been, you've been warned. I've been warned the first time that don't get an ID. The second time you do. See, he didn't know that. He didn't know that. Try to. I'm good to go with you if you're. Well, I'm good to go. Am I still detained? Thank you. Well, and uh, it just it. Thank you. I'll, I'll wait till y'all leave and then I leave. You got it. Have a good day. They don't want you on your property, sir. Okay. On private yeah, property. We just. Understood. Thank you. Thank you uh, for honoring your oath. I hope you learned something. God bless America here. They're gone. I'm still here. Enjoy your day. You understand? And that's why GCM does what he does. I love the fact that Georgia Constitution Media goes back across the road to prove his point. It really is a cherry on top of all this. But still, it always infuriates me to see cops take one side of the story and immediately play guilty until proven innocent. They detained Georgia Constitution Media because they believe the one side of the story that says the auditor was on private property, which we obviously know is not true for a couple of reasons. First of all, there is a telephone poll, and that alone proves that to be public easement. Combine that with Georgia Penal Code 16-7-21, and you'll understand perfectly that Georgia Constitution Media was well within his rights to be standing where he was and filming, no matter how quote-unquote suspicious he might have looked. You could definitely tell that the deputy that detained Georgia Constitution Media was very mad towards the end because he could not get his ID, which does raise concerns about the Columbia County Sheriff's Office, but I'm also very happy to see that Staff Sergeant help and re-educate those public servants and make them take a walk of defeat. Truly a satisfying moment right there, as it always is. But some of you might think differently compared to me about this, so please let us know what you think in the comments section down below. But also don't forget to leave us a big ol' thumbs up if you like the content we showcase, and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this, and also click on that notification bell for when we upload new videos. But most importantly of all, we want to see you go subscribe to Georgia Constitution Media, and let them know the recognizing our rights said hello, as I'll be leaving links down below as always to his channel, and the original video. Having said all that, I'll see you all later, but remember to never stop loving the Constitution.